To play the solo, you have to be overdriven. Okay, you have to play with a lot of gain or an effect pedal like an overdrive or distortion. Well, I can hear on the solo that Kurt use a fuzz pedal. That's a kind of, of overdrive pedal, uh, primarily used by I think Jimi Hendrix and The Who and Jeff Beck at his early ages. It's a very good effect. It has a lot of noise if you use to drive on the on the max on the full range. Okay. But this is about the language, isn't it? Uh, well, let's do it. Let's. <coughs> the first thing you can you can hear is this. Is this effect. Okay. Well, he used plus on it a hoto vibe kind of modulation like a note chorus that I think Jimi Hendrix uses in Bed of Gypsies record record. Okay? It sounds like this. <laughs> modulation kind of effect. Okay? Well, let's go to the execution of the song. One, two, three, four. <laughs> Sorry, the A note, then bend the G note on the the second string, a whole step, okay? G to A, bend and release. It's a great opportunity to you to practice your band with with the right pitch okay with the right intonation okay can you remember second finger helps the third finger to pull the string he is he's a little it's a, a big friend okay but has a lot to help this kind of movement band release with more active okay next we move to a G note on the fourth string too, but at this time we will we'll, we'll have to bend the F note on the second string, F to G. Let play. Let me play to you. The same thing. Bend, then release. F to G. One more time slowly. Okay, then we move to the F note on the fourth string. Then at this time we have to we have to bend a half step. Okay, not whole step. We we will we will have to bend the 
E note on the second string, fifth fret, fifth fret, a half step. E E to F. Then we have to release like the others. From the beginning of the solo, okay. Right? After the this you have to the C major scale, the, the A minor scale, sorry. Exactly, exactly, sorry, the same thing. to play the F power chord, eight notes, but it will repeat, then it will be finish on the D7 chord, okay, at, at that right interval, a flat 5 interval, okay, sharp 4, flat 5, you choose, that I, that you have learned before, right? Let's go. I will show you how to play. Let me play from the the last part of the last chorus for for you to 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 hear the 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 right the right place of the chord. Okay, one, two, three, four. <laughs> Eight notes. Open. 
bend the note, bend this note, a B note, okay, four, four, four fret, third string, but you have to pull, pull now. Noise, it's a kind of, of noise attitude, alternative attitude. Okay, one more time. This song is that kind of playing the D7. Okay, the last thing you have to know, we have to learn, is this kind of D7 chord. things in alternative guitar okay I hope you enjoy if you have any questions if you have any doubts and anything to talk to me please contact me I'll be glad to help you Daniel Jimenez peace bye bye